Hey what's up guys my name is Anand and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I'm going to be talking about Facebook Messenger ads. I will be talking about click through click to messenger ads and showing you exactly how you need to set up uh, a new ad in your Facebook business manager. But before we get started uh, let's understand why you need to utilize Facebook Messenger ads. Um, the number one reason is, you know, there are 1.3 billion people using Messenger every month. And um, that's a lot of people. And if you are a business uh, or a brand um, or an agency, and if you want to reach new people, and um, if you are tired about, you know, targeting the same audience on Facebook newsfeed um, and Instagram newsfeed, then Facebook Messenger is something that you should definitely, you know, take into consideration because of the sheer amount of people and the messages that people send on that platform. And secondly, you know, there are 10 billion messenger messages that are exchanged uh, between people and businesses every month. So um, you should definitely, you know, take into consideration this platform. And, you know, 78% of people using smartphone will will message every month by end of 2018 and we are already into 2019. So, um, you know, uh, it's really important to utilize this platform because Facebook is trying really hard um, to take control over the messaging aspect because Facebook acquired WhatsApp. It already owns, you know, Messenger and, um, and I guess uh, it's trying to consolidate, you know, message, Messenger, Instagram messages, um, and WhatsApp into one single platform and hopefully that should happen by end of 2019 or 2020. So um, the key thing here is to understand that Facebook Messenger ad is uh, super critical if you are a business um, and who and if you want to reach out to new people and start conversation. So um, the first thing that um, I'm going to talk about is how uh, click to Messenger ads will look like and look at this. Uh, basically, you know, the, the ad will be shown um, in the messenger and once, uh, you know, someone clicks on the ad, you can either promote your business uh, or an e-commerce store and everything happens in the messenger app. So um, let's get started in terms of how to set up a new ad. So the first thing that you want to do is, uh, is to log into your Facebook business manager account. Um, and um, click on the create button and um, this is where you start your new campaign. Uh, now uh, click to messenger ads um, can be created um, using either the traffic objective or messages objective. Um, but you know let's go ahead and select messages um, and then give our campaign a name click to messenger all right and then hit continue all right so um, next thing to keep in mind is um, to provide an ad set name so I'll just keep it as click to messenger all right um, now look at this this is where you know you you will choose your um, ad type and there are two different options so in this video I'm going to be uh, talking about click to messenger I'll create a separate video about sponsored messages um, but um, just to quickly uh, inform you about sponsored messages uh, with a sponsored messages ad type your message will be shown only to people who have an existing messenger conversation with your business so these are the people who have al already interacted with your brand uh, via the Facebook um, messenger or they must have already sent a message uh, through your uh, Facebook page um, and you are only able to target them uh, using the sponsored message um, ad type. But the best part about click to messenger ad is you can target anyone. You know, it can be based on interest, behavior, custom audience. Uh, so that's the best part about using click to messenger ad. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, click on uh, click to messenger. And um, the next thing that you want to do is is to set your audience. And as I, as I mentioned earlier, you know you can um, you can use your custom audience or saved audience. Um, I'm going to be giving you a pro tip um, after I 
set my detail targeting uh, but let's go ahead and choose the location so I'm gonna target everyone in the United States okay that's fine and let's assume that you know um, you are a digital marketing agency and you're trying to acquire new clients uh, then I will say that hey I want to target all the people who are interested in digital marketing so I'm just gonna select this and then I'm gonna select suggestions and I'm gonna you know quickly add a bunch of um, interest job titles and demographics uh, related to, related to digital marketing and I think this is a decent audience uh, you can you know change according to your uh, niche or your domain or industry type and you can change the targeting obviously based on your business uh, but this is just to give you a quick example of how you can go ahead in terms of detail targeting um, the next thing that I want to do is I can either save this audience um, and uh, use it next time or I can just you know move ahead um, so I mentioned about a pro tip right so one of the things uh, that you can utilize uh, when you're setting up a messenger ad is to um, you know to bring people uh, down the f sales conversion funnel so what I mean is let's say you know um, there are a bunch of people who are visiting your product page on your website or it can be um, a, uh, an important page on your website that is related to um, your free consultation offer or it can be uh, an important page on your website that is related to a webinar or something that is very important for your business and let's say um, you know people are not converting or people are not filling out the form or they are not buying the product what you can do is you can actually keep a track of all those people who are visiting your um, your page and you can build a custom audience um, out of you know page visits uh, if you don't know how to build a custom audience based out of your website traffic I have a separate video uh, in my channel about how to install a pixel and create a custom audience so what I'm saying is you can build a custom audience out of people who are visiting those important pages and then what you can do is you can retarget them with a click to messenger ad and ask them to send a message to your business through messenger um, where you can basically offer them for a free consultation or you can provide them an opportunity to ask questions about the product or something that will uh, start a conversation so that's how you know you can add that extra touch point with your brand um, and retarget people who visit your sales page but don't purchase a product um, and that's how you know um, you can uh, effectively utilize this particular feature of Facebook platform so that's your pro tip uh, so next so let's move on um, okay in terms of placement uh, what you can do is um, you can click edit placement and as I mentioned earlier uh, Facebook uh, messenger ad can be shown on Facebook feed um, you can uncheck marketplace I mean I don't think I mean if it's related to an e-commerce or something like that then you can still you know use marketplace but I usually uncheck it uh, look at that you can show your ad on Instagram which is awesome and obviously your ad will be shown on messenger inbox um, so it will look something like this um, it will be like it will be in between a couple of different conversation and a sponsored um, ad will be shown so um, moving on you can set your daily budget or lifetime budget that's fine um, you can set an end date and you can basically you know um, by default Facebook will select add uh, optimization delivery so it's rep it's uh, set to replies uh, which basically means uh, Facebook will deliver your ads to people most likely to have a conversation uh, with you through messages so everything looks great um, let's continue um, and this is where you know you will create your actual ad so what you will do is um, you can provide uh, your ad name and then choose your Facebook page and Instagram account um, and look at this you have four different formats so you can either use a carousel ad a single image sorry video or slideshow um, I'm fine with single image 
uh, I'm just gonna browse my library and quickly choose my image over here so uh, this um, ad is about you know Google display network targeting options so uh, basically um, what I'm trying to do over here is I'm I'm gonna ask people to request for a free consultation um, and I'm gonna ask if they have any questions about my previous tuto tutorial video so um, I've selected an Im image over here and I'm gonna say request for a free consultation and then talk to our digital marketing experts all right so that's my uh, text and then I'm gonna my headline is um, request free consultation that's my call to action or headline uh, send message looks great okay um, now this is where uh, the fun part is um, so with messenger ad you can either use a standard template or a custom template um, and I usually select custom template because um, it it allows you to create um, you know customized personalized um, you know messages default messages um, that will be related to your ad so I have already created a template for a free consultation and this is how it will look like so let's say someone clicks on my ad and they click on this button that says send message um, it will automatically open messenger and this will be the default message that will be shown so it will be like hi Anand uh, please let us know how we can help you and then uh, an image um, a title request an appointment and free consultation um, you can either um, you know um, use a standard template I mean it doesn't work great I mean you can you can edit it and and as you can see you know it's all text based uh, you can add a personalization um, you can add like frequently asked questions uh, but what I would suggest is click on custom templates and then click create new template and then look at this you have like three different options text only text and image and text and video so um, let's go ahead and select text and image and then look at the look at this this is your initial greeting hi Anand please let us know how we can help you okay that's fine and then I'm gonna select the same image that I used for my ad you can choose a different image uh, it's up to you you can add an image title um, you know, how can we help you or something like that um, um, and then you can say free consultation okay so look at this um, so that's your initial text and now comes the customer actions so this is the most important part you can actually set quick replies so this is my first uh, quick reply it says I would like to learn more you can add another reply that says um, talk to sales um, so you can use this quick reply if you are uh, promoting your product and um, basically you are in the final stage of selling your product and asking people to talk to sales so that can be a quick reply you can say um, schedule an appointment so that can be a third quick reply and look at this so the your your potential prospect when he's interacting with your business through messenger he has all those three buttons and he can just simply click on that button and boom um, your con conversation has started so that's how you know you can set your custom templates you can hit finish uh, but before that what you can do is you can click on this preview in messenger and Facebook will send a notification um, on your phone and you can actually see how it looks like on your mobile if you're happy with it you can hit finish and you can use it so that's pretty much it guys um, you know how you can create uh, a messenger ad um, how you can utilize you know custom templates and uh, target people based on website visits you can use custom audience you can use your saved audience you can uh, target people based on their interest behavior um, and basically you know uh, utilize click to messenger ads uh, to close the you know close the sales deal or to request for a free consultation or anything that will help you to convert your potential prospect or lead into a customer so that's it guys for the video uh, if you like this video, make sure to subscribe to my channel. 
I, I post weekly digital marketing videos and if you have any questions let me know in the comment section and I'll see you next time.